Hello everybody, and welcome back to Waged Wars. Wars are not surprisingly very good at influencing people and their opinions. Not only in the minds of soldiers that fight them, but the people back at home will hear about what the soldiers are doing. This influence can totally change the culture of a generation. This is in no better way shown than the language and lingo used by said generations. So with that, let's discuss one of the sayings that originated from the time most of the western world was trying to kill each other, World War II. The saying for today is, the whole nine yards. I'm sure most of you have heard of it and know what it means, and according to Wicked definition is everything, or the whole lot, or when used as an adjective, all the way. That's cool and all, but why do we say this, and where does it come from? I'm sure the reason will be a lot more than you expected, so let's dive right in. During World War II, the war in the air was crucial to winning. Having superior air power is largely responsible for Germany's early war victories in Poland and France, and the Allies' late war triumphs. As Winston Churchill once said, not to have an adequate air force in the present state of the world is to compromise the foundations of national freedom and independence. And for how important planes and air power was, these planes would be largely ineffective if it wasn't for their guns and armaments. Pilots, bombers, and many other types of gunners will be useless against the enemy's onslaught of fighters and anti-aircraft if they didn't have their armaments to defend themselves. And of course, you can't have guns without ammunition to fire out of said guns. The ammunition belts put into American planes was always a very specific length to maximize efficiency in airborne battle and efficiency in manufacturing. The length of these ammunition belts was 27 feet, or more simply, 9 yards. When pilots and gunners would commit to firing at a target, it was always a risky affair. If the shots fired missed, then it would be a waste of precious ammunition. But if you didn't attempt to fire an enemy aircraft, then it could always fire at you. It was a risky gamble, so the phrase evolved into use. If a gunner saw a target in the air and made the decision it had to be shot down, he would commit to using all nine yards of his available ammunition belt. This concept eventually evolved into a common phrase among airmen to use on the ground and the air to refer to committing something fully or all the way. So there you have it. That's the simple but interesting origins of a simple phrase we use every day. Thanks to you all for watching.